think that it's important for Latino families especially to um, be so health conscious and keep count of their calories and stuff? Yeah. Well, I mean, but first of all, Latinos have the highest incidence of obesity, diabetes, heart disease. Latinas have the number one, uh, you know, they die more of a heart disease than any other ethnic wow. group. Mm -hmm. So for more reason, we need to emphasize, you know, balance. Because that's the key to good nutrition. It's about balancing your calories. It's about balancing all the nutrients. And you do that by adding variety. By eating the same thing every day, that's not going to give you balance. But you achieve balance by having a variety of things, grains, fruits, vegetables, dairy, protein, all within the same meal all the time. And I mean, you can vary a little bit, but the more variety, you know, always go back to that. Because that's what's going to give you that. Now, with Hispanics, we have a couple of problems. We love to eat. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> we love to, I mean, there is nothing more exciting for a Latino that, mm, I'm going to sit down and eat today. Yes. And the minute you and walk in that door, it's comiste. The comiste, vente pa' acá. Uh-huh. Siéntate. Exactly. <laughs> and, you know, and the problem is, you know, it's good to eat, of course, but it's the portion sizes. I mean, oh, yes. one portion of rice is a half a cup. I mean, think about three cups is more of a serving of rice for us. Then you add the gandules and the, you know, the, the platano frito, yeah. mofongo, who knows? And they, the calories just keep adding and adding and adding. Next to you know, you could have had two, three thousand calories in one single meal. In one single meal. That's way more. You know, and we're not six foot tall. No, we're not. So we're not out there. You know, 2,000 calories for us is pretty much maintaining your current weight. So in order to lose weight, you have to decrease 500 calories more. So just to put it in perspective, that our main problem is it's not so much that we don't have variety, because I think we do have a lot of variety, even though sometimes we go a little more in the carbohydrate side, rice, yuca, potatoes, you know, all that stuff. But I think the portion sizes, we need to shrink it, and we also need to be more active. You know, that's really missing. I mean, if our hair gets, God forbid our hair gets curly, <laughs> we have to time it right, you know, no quiero sudar. So we have to really keep that, in, you know, exercise needs to be balanced with the food that we're consuming every day. And that's so important for Hispanics, you know, we need to exercise a little more and we need to decrease those portions.